Hello everyone. Today the video we will share about uh, dual protector syntax. Uh, whether should we change our play path for normal attack or should we play with the poison skill path? Right. Right here you could see my uh, play right now is a ASP tab with the normal attack and the DPS is about 600k and I have upgrade tier 5 right now uh, and with my current state I just have about 60 or 15k of the P attack uh, I have 62 plus P10, 44, okay, about 100 plus. My SPD right now I have 404 plus 148 here, about 580 plus. Uh, because I have this shadow equipment with level 5, I enable this skill to have additional 30% of SPD. Uh, then we have additional uh, life skill. Yeah. So the other thing I think I should have major of the skill being max level and the next we need to compare if we change to skill type or SPD does benefit which one is much more better in terms of training. Uh, let's go to the training ground to have a better idea. For me, right now, I, I have spent a lot of things and my upgrade is tier 5 enchantment with tier 2 and uh, or I go with the Proterra enchantment as well as the Morok for my weapon uh, Let's take the Eclipse as benchmark Uh, with my testing, I could see about 600 plus of the uh, more than 600 k of the P, uh, DPS should be uh, about 640 to 650. Uh, I did try with some of the combo, uh, like with the slash. Uh, it could slightly increase a little bit in terms of the DPS, but doesn't make the big difference even with the shadow blade um, slightly increased but not that good but now we will see about 680 as long as uh, there's no lag of miss uh, for the normal attack then the DPS should be around here 730k like let it wait for 1 minute and let's see 680k and it's not going to be ok let's take it at 680 uh, by right the good comparison is uh, we should change uh, the same tier of the uh, right now I'm using without any card with the enchantment and upgrade and the next I have to move to my gold equipment with 32% of P attack which will make me my character about um, about 23k of P attack okay Currently I do not have any attack damage card but I just put the opium for PvP set. Uh, I have another marine spear but for the comparison purpose I think I just put it as it is. If you could see my my main board over here is about 33k of P attack and I should change to MVP loadout. Uh, I think right now I could level up one more skill after tier 5. Yeah. It's about 28 seconds that I could go for. Uh, same with this one. Stroll with Troy as well. 
so my skill combo I think I did share before uh, we put one poison then follow with venom knife then we will follow with one soul destroyer then we have the combo the combo we have venom dark knife and ambush then we follow with double slash and venom splash okay for another two it's just for the standby manually focus let's go into it go back to mini eclipse and i believe with the shadow equipment level for the skill i use the three level ambush right with the venom knife then slash i will use the, the third one Let's go. I believe this will be a contribute of about 700 k and above for the DPS. Uh, let's see how it turns out after one minute. So a lot of people are are, are craving for the double uh, double attack from the same act. Uh, because we can see the crazy number that's showing out from from the screen but uh, to me I think before the SE6 with the shadow equipment level 6 uh, this skill I, I believe could easily improve about the damage about at least 10% and more uh, for now I think uh, before SE6 I think better we, we, we stay with the um, skill play right. let's see what is the dps right now about 800k so which means there's about 150k differences this is not fair enough to compare uh, straight like that because uh, my I'm using a gold talisman. Uh, if we can use the gold talisman for the uh, ASPD, I think we can add another 80% of ASPD speed. Um, it could maybe can lead the damage up to 700k. Uh, so I think for right now, still got at least 100k differences in terms of DPS. Right. So I think before SE6 or maybe before the enchantment tier uh, tier 3 or tier 4 probably I think we maintain as the skill or poison build which will contribute a lot but uh, DPS so we could see about 800k or 790k so my recommendation is we should continue with the poison build to enhance the additional uh, uh, okay i think that's all for today i think the conclusion is i think before fe6 i think we should continue to stay with the uh, portion play okay thank you